Question of the Week from the Naked Scientists. Hello, I'm Adam Murphy, and this week we are answering this question from Vinny. I have read mosquitoes have a preference for blood type and prefer people with type O blood over those with type B. Is this true? And how do they know the difference between types? Are you one of those people that mosquitoes are just drawn to? Or, like me, are you lucky enough that you get to be smug that mosquitoes will only come to you as a last resort? Could your blood have something to do with that? I reached out to Imo Hansen from New Mexico State University to find out. There is one study from 2004 on the landing preference of Asian tiger mosquitoes, Aedes albopictus, on people with different blood types. Shirari and co-workers found that this species of mosquitoes prefers to land on subjects that had blood group O compared with subjects of all other blood types. Uh-oh, then, for people with O blood types. But how can a blood type impact what's happening? Blood types are defined by specific carbohydrates or sugars that are on the surface of the red blood cells. When they applied these sugar antigens to the forearms of test subjects, they found that subjects treated with the antigen for blood type O attracted more mosquitoes than subjects treated with antigens for all other blood types. These antigens are also the reason people with A-type blood can't take from people with B-type blood. The H antigen is found on all blood types, so if you only have that, you've got type O blood and can give to others, especially mosquitoes, apparently. With this study, these scientists confirmed an earlier study from 1972 that was performed by Wood and co-workers, and they showed that blood type O is more attractive than blood type B, which is more attractive than blood type AB, which is more attractive than blood type A. A more recent study from 2019 from Prasadini and co-workers shows that yellow fever mosquitoes also prefer blood type O if they can choose between the four different blood types in an artificial feeding system. The big question, however, is how mosquitoes can distinguish between subjects with different blood types, since host blood is usually not directly exposed to the air. Mosquitoes find their hosts using their sense of smell, so there must be some difference in the olfactory cues that subjects with different blood types excrete, but those differences are still unknown. And it's worth mentioning the blood type isn't the only factor. There's loads of chemicals in sweat. And as Flummoxed points out on the forum, being pregnant and even a few beers can change how mosquitoes respond to you. Thanks very much to Imo for flying in with that answer. Next time we're tackling this one from Jeff. How is it that there are rising sea levels impacting some island nations, such as the Maldives or Kiribati, yet 1,000 kilometres in any direction, there is no discernible sea level change at all? So what do you think? You can email chris at thenakedscientists.com, find us on Facebook, tweet at Naked Scientists, or join in the debate on the forum. That's thenakedscientists.com slash forum. Thanks very much for listening, and until next time, goodbye. Thank you.